Earlier this year, the Chinese Environment Ministry noted that China's coastal areas have risen by over three millimeters per year over the recent few decades. How much of a threat does rising sea levels pose for China, especially when we look at big cities like Shanghai? The risk is huge, and it's already, pro it's already proven. Uh, you mentioned Shanghai. Actually, Shanghai is located in the Yangtze River Delta region. Not only the, this region, but also the Pearl River Delta region, where Guangzhou, Shenzhou are next to Hong Kong. And that particular region has also proven very vulnerable. China, if you look at the coastal areas, uh, more than uh, half of the population uh, clustered reside actually in coastal regions there. And this region, ha you know, the coastal region happens to be the economically most advanced population most densely populated. And if you look at the, you know, the concentration of industrial uh, activities, manufacturing, supply chain, whatever, many, many of them actually are located in these regions there. From an impact perspective, and I think flooding, uh, sea level rise plus actually flooding, uh, you know, has been experienced more and more. We already started to experience coastal erosion and, uh, and also damage to coastal habitats as well as salinization of surface and the groundwater there. So the impact is huge. I think one, of course, on people, people's lives and the livelihoods, and then also on the infrastructure, infrastructure both the urban infrastructure, but also industrial infrastructure. And, uh, and also, actually, we've started to see you know, damages, actually, to the ecosystems along the coastal areas, like wetlands uh, you know, and other habitats, and already threatening dramatically uh, the other lives on Earth as well.